Artificial Intelligence, or better known as AI, is a computer program or a machine that can imitate or simulate human intelligence with abilities such as learning, reasoning, perceiving, problem solving, decision making, and understanding languages. AI types are classified into two groups. The first one is based on capability and the second one is based on functionality. Under the capability based group, there are three types and these are weak AI. In here, a computer programs or a machine's ability to perform a single task. As an example, Amazon uses AI to recommend to the customer what to buy next. Strong AI. In here, computer programs or machines ability to perform with human-like capabilities. Movies such as The Terminator is an example of strong AI. Super intelligence AI. In here, computer programs or machines ability to perform exceedingly better than human. Movies such as The Minority Report is a good example of super intelligence AI. Under the functionality based group, there are four types and these are reactive machines. IBM supercomputer that beat the world champion in chess is an example of this type. It only reacts to a present situation of the game. Limited memory. Self-driving cars are an example of this type. They use a limited memory to respond to a present situation on the road. Theory of mind. This type functions to recognize human emotions, thoughts, and beliefs. There is no real progress of such AI. Movies such as Her is a good example of this type. Self-awareness. To date, self-aware AI does not exist. This type functions with its own conscious and self-awareness. Movies such as Nine is a good example of this type. Knowledge approach. This approach relies on human knowledge. A machine or a computer program uses its searching capabilities to find answers in the knowledge base. Let's demonstrate this with an example. Suppose Ali applies for a bank loan. Within minutes, the bank provides him with an answer. In here, the bank utilizes a program that has used the logic from the knowledge base to accept or reject Ali's application. Data approach. This approach relies on data, lots of data. A machine or a computer program learns by itself from the data without being programmed. In our loan example, the bank utilizes a program that has learned from historical data to accept or reject Ali's application. Data knowledge approach. This approach combines the two approaches explained above. In our loan example, the bank utilizes a program that has learned from the historical data to find insights, then uses the knowledge base to accept or reject Ali's application. There are six core branches of AI. The first one is called expert systems. These are computer programs that simulate the human ability to make decisions and reasoning. Applications of expert system including diagnosing a disease and treating it. The second branch is called vision. These are computer programs that simulate the human ability to see and manipulate images and videos. Applications of vision systems include resolving complex road accidents. The third branch is called robotics. These are physical mechanical machines that simulate the human ability to move. Applications of robotic systems include handling logistic material in a warehouse. The fourth branch is called speech recognition. These are computer programs that simulate the human ability to speak and listen. Applications of speech recognition systems include translating spoken language. The fifth branch is called natural language processing or NLP. These are computer programs that simulate the human ability to read and write. Applications of NLP system includes extracting information from books and articles. The sixth branch is called machine learning. These are computer programs that simulate the human ability to learn. Applications of machine learning systems include predicting financial budgets. Machine learning is a branch of artificial intelligence that can learn on its own and become progressively better from experience at executing a task. The way machine learning works is by creating a model and training its algorithms with data or by trial and error to accurately perform a task. A model is just a fancy word for a computer program. An algorithm is another fancy word for a set of rules and instructions. 
There are three methods in which a machine can learn, and these are supervised learning. In here, you train the algorithms with data that contains answers. Examples of supervised learning include, in medicine, predicting whether a person will get diabetes. In education, recommending courses for a student to enroll in the university. Unsupervised learning. In here, you train the algorithms with data that contains no answers. Examples of unsupervised learning include, in medicine, detecting unusual and unknown heartbeat rates or rhythms from the electrocardiogram or ECG chart. In tourism, finding patterns on what people do when visiting various tourist attractions. Reinforcement learning. In here, the machine is given a goal, and through trial and error and receiving feedback, it figures out the best action to achieve that goal. Example of reinforcement learning includes, in trading, a machine learns whether to hold, buy or sell stocks at a particular price and market conditions.